Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're new, hi, my name's Lou and welcome to Lou Amazing. So today I'm going to share with you my morning study routine as a math major. Um, as you can see from the window at the back, it was really, really dark. I woke up at five and I was doing calculus. I was studying ordinary differential equations in calculus and bro, bro, somebody needs to chill with these steroids because mm -mm, what was I even doing? <laughs> So I thought I had understood the day this was taught. So this morning I was just doing some questions and stick around to see what my lecturer said about my answers. I work hard each and every day. I get lost in the words I say. I don't push pause, no, I push play. I won't stop till I make a change. I withdraw on the things I make. I turn flaws into flawless traits I build tall, never cap in space I won't stop till I hear him say So that was my morning um, study routine I felt a little sleepy at the beginning, I'm not going to lie So I can say I actively started studying at 5.30 and finished at 6 47 um there's a lot i need to work on but i think i got i not i think i did get the general idea of what i'm supposed to do yeah um so right now i actually turned on not that i was filming with the ring light the entire time but i turned on my ring light because i want to take photos of the exercise questions that I did and just send them to my lecturer so that he can mark them and tell me where I went wrong. I never used to do this in previous semesters but since we're going to be a good student, I'm gonna do it. Okay. A few moments later. Okay, let's have a quick chat. Okay, it's still morning. The time is 8.20. Like, it was 8.20 when I was setting up my camera and stuff. So, um... My lecturer has already um, checked my work <laughs> and it was wrong. <laughs> Bro, I literally calculated in like three. So I woke up early, uh, did examples, which were obviously correct because like they're examples and then got like the general idea, right? And then I did the exercises and submitted my work for him to grade. Only one was correct. <laughs> the rest were wrong <laughs> oh my goodness that that's quite something bro that's quite something hmm. and so there's probably somebody out there who was like oh no lumazing wakes up early to study and she just has math easy she understands it like look at her solve and calculate oh what 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 sis it was wrong <laughs> It was really really wrong but I am not mad about it okay I'm taking this as a way of correcting myself basically and the good part is he told me where I went wrong I had a problem with my integration so I just need to work on that and then I told him I would um, give him the correction later in the day which I will um, the point is there are times when you wake up, study, or stay up late, study, you put in the work, especially for mathematics. You put in the work, you do your calculations, you go through past papers, but the truth is you're doing it all wrong. Probably because you don't know the concept, or maybe um, while solving, you don't know how to do something. In my case, I didn't know how to um, integrate. I got the concept, it was correct, the method was correct, but the integration was wrong, thereby making my entire answer wrong. So if you are practicing mathematics, I highly, highly encourage you to always get your work checked, either by your teacher or by a student in your class, like a fellow um, student or pupil who knows that topic to the T like the back of their palm hand the back of their hand <laughs> anyway so yeah yeah that's i feel like that's the takeaway from this video there are times when we calculate every single day and put in the work but we're doing it all wrong and we feel like oh no why 
why am I not getting A's? Why am I not getting B's? I always wake up to study. I always do this and do that. Sis, you're doing it wrong. Okay, get your work checked. It doesn't hurt. Well, I mean, it kind of hurts because you feel like, oh, wow, I got that wrong. But then the good part is this wasn't an exam. This was just me studying. And of course, I feel a little bad. Like, ugh, I didn't know that. But the gain is that I'm going to work on my integration. I'm going to do that exercise again. Give him my um, correction and he's going to go through it. If it's correct, great. I now know the concept and I now know the right thing to do. If it's wrong, not great. I need to redo it until I get it right, okay? And so, if any of these questions come in the exam, sis, I'm gonna, I'm gonna ace it, period. <laughs> but yeah, um, this was my first morning. <sighs> I didn't get the result that I wanted because I thought I would get the concept like this, but it's fine. Um, this is a habit that I'm building. And with time, I will get the hang of things. And yeah, I I don't know. You guys just watched me fail. And <laughs> I'm not gonna lie though. I feel like this video was very motivating and encouraging at the beginning. And you were feeling like, oh wow. She's doing math. And she likes it. And she wakes up to study. And no, no, no. Um, yeah. Nobody is born great. Nobody is born a math genius. You fail and learn and fail and learn and fail and learn and that's how people pass or that's how people become great um, with time. So yeah, you might not get your results in this semester or you might not get your results the very day you want them because you've done things right. But with time, you'll definitely see a difference. So tip of the day, whenever you solve mathematics or calculate your stuff, always ask your teacher to go through it and give you pointers on where you are wrong or where you are right i'm definitely going to apply this to other subjects other courses i take especially physics because now i'm actually you know you know getting the hang of things hang of things <laughs> but yeah um right now i'm just going to drink my coffee and and read a book before I can do my correction. I'm going to read a book. I'm reading one chapter. So that's also another goal of mine. I actually got this from Nyemba Tembo. Shout out to Nyemba. I'm reading a book she recommended, Atomic Habits, uh, by I think James Clare, if I'm not mistaken. And it's going good so far. So I'm just going to read one chapter. That's it. One chapter for the day. Don't come for me. At least I'm reading. So yeah, one chapter for the day and then prepare myself for my classes, have class, um, do my correction, obviously. <laughs> and yeah, study the rest of the stuff on my timetable. I'm not going to film the rest because I feel like this video will be too long if I do that and boring. But I don't know, was this, was this interesting? I don't even know if it was interesting. Okay, now I feel like I'm talking too much while holding a coffee mug trying to look fancy you know the vibes <laughs> i'm kidding i'm kidding let me put this away because obviously i'm not even going to drink from it i'm just you know trying to give it bougie vibes <laughs> anyway anyway um thank you so much for watching this video till this far i really appreciate it i will see you in my next video <laughs> bye